What's up YouTube? I'm Vaughn and this is the Gear Channel where we discuss collectibles, hobbies, compare games, fun tabletop video games and today we are clarifying on a specific video that we posted last week which was the Digimon First Place Meta Deck Commandramon. Now this video actually received quite a bit of controversy especially with a scene that he was playing two Super Eradication Attack now, a lot of people assume that it was either playing it just as a security option card, while majority of you was actually assuming that he was just cheating with it and playing it even without having a red card in the deck. So in today's video, we are clarifying the reason why he was actually playing this because we actually contacted Bond Station, which was the card store that was hosting this specific tournament and is the one that uploaded this deck list. So, Make sure to actually like and subscribe the channel because we actually did a lot of work to find the truth behind this specific deck. Now, first off, if you're new to the channel, you might not be aware of this third option, but sometimes the deck list on our meta deck breakdowns are actually just not correct. So a lot of the times card stores make mistakes. We actually saw this with Bilzomon which the player won with Bilzomon X, but the whole deck list did not even have one Bilzomon X, but he still had the X antibody option, and he also had cluster in the deck. So we've seen this mistake multiple times. So this was also a third option that could possibly be. So to confirm it, I contacted Bond Station to clarify more on what card he was playing. And to my knowledge, I was actually correct. So first off, the super eradication attack is set number is BT12108 and the correct card was actually BT11108 which is the GD dimension. Now this is a card that is much more fitted especially for this specific deck but this actually explained a lot. So one thing that we have to know is that especially for all card stores to make sure that you actually post the correct deck list because we've seen this happen many many times and this can actually tarnish a player's reputation, especially with mistakes like this. So to avoid these type of issues, you should double check it before uploading it because I'm not the only person that actually goes and follows these deck lists. And I'm definitely not the only YouTuber that actually reviews these deck lists as well. So to avoid any issues, please double check all your deck lists before posting it just to avoid any issues. And that's it for today's video. If you guys enjoyed today's video, you know what to do. Like and subscribe. And if you want sneak peek of future products we're planning to review here on the channel, you can follow me on my Instagram, Vaughn Gear. I'm Vaughn and this was the Gear Channel.